Okay, I've got the charge piping done for the RX-7 and the bumper fit back on. Uh, I didn't record, put this back together because it's kind of redundant. Um, but I did get the two um, HD clamp assembly upper uh, charge pipes done for each side. Uh, on this car, I actually got both sides to be identical in length. So, um, yeah, it's symmetrical, as symmetrical as, as it's going to be. I did the cold side and then I duplicated the cuts and was able to rotate them some uh, to make the hot side fit as well so each side is going to be the same length. But that's all together. Uh, now it's time to get it up in the air and I'm going to work on the downpipe and redoing the dump tube. So I'll show you some close ups of that and uh, get in the air and get it going. I've got some photos and videos of the bumper off, I'll show you those, but you can see the HD assembly. And they both just follow down. And it's pretty simple, since you, when you take the clamshell clamp off, it'll just pop out. So there's no more blown off charge pipes, no, uh, the other pipes weren't bead rolled to start with. So uh, you won't have any of those issues here. One pipe for each side, HD clamp, it's good to go. All right, I've got the downpipe and dump tube all fit up. 90% um, welded on the downpipe. What I'll do is I'll go ahead and uh, get it back on the car, test fit it one more time before I do the last weld on it, and uh, put the O2 bung in it, and just to double check and make sure it fits 100%, which it should, because uh, it's all marked. Uh, the easiest way to make these long downpipes is I'll fit it all up and weld the two halves separate. That way you're not trying to flip some big piece uh, and make the system weld. It's much easier to break the pieces down per the bend angle to be able to weld it in smaller pieces and then assemble it and weld it as one big assembly. So uh, yeah, I'll show you that and um, I'll stop right here and finish the final weld while the hot parts cool off. I'll just finish it Monday and uh, get it all back on the car. But again, I appreciate y'all checking it out.